This is the Nova Corps. We have a situation. Thanos is here! Destroyer of Worlds, Big Glowy Gauntlet, Wrinkly Chin. Yeah, I've heard of him. You have to help us. This is a priority one distress call, Star-Lord. I don't have to do anything. What's in it for me? Uh, we, um, we'll, we'll expunge your past crimes from your record. Uh, hijacking a Star Blaster on Xandar? Sounds pretty fair. You've got yourself a deal. Ah, oh, I'm relieved to hear that. Okay, here's the situation. We tracked Thanos to this Kree planet, but when our fighters engaged, he decimated our fleet. Without your help, he'll kill us all. We're no match for him. Damn it, space cops. You made a mess here. And now we're all paying for it. That is clearly understood. You don't have to point that out. Please hurry! Time to rock and roll. Looks like death out there. Business as usual. I'm not complaining. You two want to quit making out and help me before we explode? Thanks, Yumi. And fixed! On to the next disaster! And that is... Where to begin? Thrusters fried, compilers spitting out carbon... I'm, I'm through! Oh, and now Groot's on fire! Groot's on fire! Peter! Ah. <laughs> I am Groot. Oh, Groot says thanks. Wait, if you're all here, who the hell is flying my ship? Whoa, 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 Trax! Do not distract me, Star-Lord. Thanos is here. Today, I finally slay our nemesis. My dead wife and daughter shall have their vengeance. I have longed for this day of death. Nothing like starting your day with a little revenge. Yes, that is my mantra. Move, tracks. I was enjoying myself. Yeah, well, I'd enjoy you shutting up, okay? Off to a great start today. I am grueled. Alright guys, let me show you how it's done. I am Groot. Okay. Now I'm really pissed. Ugh, disgusting. We have a bathroom for that. Where is the other green one? <sighs> Wishing we had better seatbelts. Still breathing. Mm -hmm. Oh no! Get 
Get me down! Get me down! My sweet, precious little baby! There's an infant on our ship. Well, that can't be good. Where is it? Where is it? Hey! Get down here! I mean, up here! Whatever! Stubby little arms. Would you calm down, man? You're freaking out. It's freaking me out. Calm down? We're all gonna be red paste in a second if you don't help me. Careful with that. <sighs> My baby, give it. Another nanosecond, and we all would have been atomized. Still looks like it'll blow up to me. It sure ain't no toy. We get pushed around by a lot of dangerous jerks. I built this bad boy to push back. <laughs> ain't she a beaut? Still, if you had something that dangerous on board, you should have told me. Us. You should have told us. I told Groot! <sighs> So this is how I die. The Mad Titan arrives. He is heading towards those ruins. Looks like the Nova Corps failed. It's up to us to take him down. Just the five of us. And that gun. <laughs> Door's not gonna budge so easily. <laughs> yeah, well. Okay, so this gun ain't totally, you know, operational yet. And it only has one shot. But think of it as a feature. Yeah. Okay. We'll find another way in. Thanks for understanding, Pete. I'll make sure you're not in the blast radius when this sucker finally goes off. Think I see a way over. Tread lightly, Star Lord. Thanos must not detect our presence. I'm not going to tread at all. So many more pieces now. Oh, don't be so dramatic.
find the Nova Corps. Yeah, um... They're all dead. Hang on. I'll find you guys a way through. Looks like some kind of... ugh... fungus. Maybe? found a crashed Nova Corps ship. Right smack through the wall. Yeah. Ouch. Yeah. I think its guns can blast the door open, but I can't get into the cockpit. Check the side. Should be an access override panel. I, uh, might have stripped one of these ships for parts before. Found the panel, but I can't get it open. Yeah, you're gonna need an override chip to access it. High-ranking officers usually carry them. Maybe I can figure out who was in charge. Well, I've got the time scanner. These guys weren't in charge. Guys, I, I almost got it figured out. Just hold tight. I am Groot. Groot says holding tight.
this damage in the fight, or is it supposed to look like this? With their uniforms, it's... it's kind of hard to tell them apart. Bingo! I need you. Got it. Are you guys still out there? Affirmative, Star-Lord. Surprise! Why should I be surprised? Species, strong of body, powerful of military. What is Thanos even doing here? What does he want with this place? Guess we'll find out. I know one thing for certain. I gotta get this thing working or we're all dead. I'm almost done tinkering. We're counting on you, Rocket. Nothing inspires the creative soul like intense pressure, right? Hey, I think this can take us down. If the controls aren't too damaged. Eh, no big deal, Gams. I can undamage him. I am Groot. And Groot says he's worried we bit off more than we can chew. Ah, why don't you relax, you big wooden baby? Who wouldn't be? Mm, I am Groot. There is nothing to fear. I will protect both of you cowards. There. Good as new. The time has come. Either Thanos falls, or we do. On my planet, before a great battle, our fearless leader would rally the troops with his words. Thanos is done terrorizing the innocent people of this galaxy. It's time for payback. Yes. Revenge. Always a noble pursuit.
this is the slowest elevator in the universe. You cannot possibly know that. take you down. So were the Nova Corps. But as you can see, Guardians, now that I have this, I shall roll through the galaxy like a great wave, crushing the bones of every inhabitant and the civilizations of every planet I uh, pass. Oh, let me guess. It's a ancient super weapon. Or something. The Eternity Forge. Called it! Daughter, you have aligned yourself with such pathetic creatures. I was never your daughter. Then you will die an adversary. Oh, can't we talk about this? You know, discuss your feelings, figure out why you're so angry. You speak like a petulant child. Show me how you die. For training me to kill. I'll put it to good use. Groot! 
this mechanical nonsense? Why are there three triggers? Peter! No way. <laughs> Guys, uh, we're heroes. Thanos is dead. Gonna be rich! <laughs> Heroes get fat stacks, right? That's how this works! Heroes don't do it for the money, Rocket. And I am in the wrong line of work! Guess this relic is useless. Huh. <laughs> but this gun wasn't! Who did? You did! Rocket, you quit it! Did? Stop it, both of you! Enough! We are victorious. The biggest terror the galaxy has ever known is no more. I am Groot! I... I never thought this would happen. Yeah! What do we do now?
for. Only top shelf booze for the man who killed Thanos. I've got some thousand year old Centaurian ale. Hey, drinks for my team. Five drinks coming right up. I still can't believe we did it. Thanos is gone. <laughs> believe it. If it weren't for all this, the Guardians fighting Thanos, do you think we still would have ended up together? All of us. You did attack me the first time we met, so, uh... Yeah, I have my doubts. <laughs> yeah, you make a good point. I'm not apologizing for that, by the way. You have to admit, we aren't the most likely group of friends. <sighs> Without Thanos, we might just end up driving each other crazy. I mean, with Drax and Rocket. Well, that's what family is, Gamora. You drive each other crazy, but at the end of the day, none of that matters. If we're a family, only because you made us one. Honestly, we all stay because of you, Peter. You're the one who's gonna keep us from falling apart. Uh, wow. Uh, yeah, no pressure. <laughs> Technically, uh, you know, I was the one that shot Thanos, but, uh... I expect this from the tree and rodent, but from you... I am no longer in the mood to celebrate! Yes, 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 this is the gun that blew a hole in Thanos, but no! You can't do shots on it. Okay, maybe just one. <laughs> hey, Rocket. So, as I was saying, I built this brilliant, beautiful piece of machinery with my own two hands. I can tell you're impressed by my uh, technological virility. Huh. <laughs> You're just lucky I'm a good shot. Ooh! And you're lucky this gun ain't got another charge. What is your problem, Quill? We just killed the biggest bad guy in the universe, and you can't even let me enjoy it for one second? Nah, I don't need this. Maybe me and Groot should go back to being just a duo. Focus on the stuff that really matters. Making money. What good is saving the galaxy? if you won't even share the credit. You can't leave us, man. We gotta keep the band together. 
Oh, I can't? I'll start by leaving this damn bar. Rocket, come on. You all wouldn't last a week without me. I am rude. Guess everything ends, you know? I am Groot. Drinking out of a galactic super weapon, I see. Bold. Nice to see you're enjoying yourself. We just killed Thanos. Why aren't you celebrating? Not really in the mood. It's just... It's been a... complicated day. How about a refill? Why not? On my way. You disrespectful human! How dare you! Oh, man, I... You know what? I'm sorry about that. <laughs> Wasn't looking where I was going. And I'm drunk. Watch your steps, Star Lord. Guess not everyone's a fan. At least I managed not to drop this. My hero. I try. Thanos murdered your people. I, I thought you'd be happier once he was gone. He was a monster, yes. But he was also my family. Oh, come on, forget Thanos. He's dead. You're not. You deserve to have some fun. Don't make light of this, Peter. He will always be a part of who I am. Thinking about Nebula. I called her that. We both called Thanos father. He used to force us to fight to prove who was worthy of being called his daughter. I won. Well, it made you strong. You're one of the best fighters I know. Still, it haunts me. Neb stabbed me while I was sleeping, because I won. Imagine how she's gonna react when she finds out we killed Thanos. She loved him, I think. Oh, she is gonna be pissed. No kidding. There's a small part of me that wants to see my sister again. But when she finds out what we did, she's gonna lose her mind. She'll hunt us all down and kill us. Like you said, she's your sister. Trust me, family's worth fighting for. Maybe you're right. I'll try to call her after a few more of these. Two family, huh? Two family. Where is everyone? Yeah, uh, Drax and I have a little, uh, difference of opinion. And Rocket and Groot? Rocket might also be mad at me. <laughs> this should be good. For you. Ah, uh, why? We got a big, big problem. Okay. It was not my fault. 
I barely consumed my body weight in that toxic liquid. Hey, I was surrounded by adoring fans. I couldn't let them go thirsty. Oh, I don't care who ordered all the drinks. We need to figure out how to pay our tab. Well, I do have a solution to that problem. Even Captain Killjoy over here is gonna love it. In fact, it's so good, he'll probably take all the credit for it after. Well, it depends on what the idea is. What? It's all gold coming out of this brain. We're gonna sell Thanos' body! I am... That is... not a bad idea. Selling a corpse? How could that be profitable? There are people who would find it valuable. Exactly. And I know just the guy. The Collector. He loves buying exotic crap for his museum, so Thanos, the newly dead Titan, will be perfect. He'll pay you tons of units for that body. I... hate that idea. Ah, it's just too brilliant for your mind to comprehend. It's okay. Or... we could turn Thanos over to the Nova Corps. They've had an official bounty on his head for years. Plus, it comes with the added benefit of not having to deal with criminals. Like the Collector. He's a corrupt thug, bottom line. But the Nova Corps, they maintain peace and order in the galaxy. The hell with the Nova Corps. I don't care about those clowns. You and me, Pete, are in complete agreement. Plus, we'd make way more money with the Collector. Guys, we just killed the biggest, baddest criminal in history. We shouldn't turn right around and become one ourselves. <sighs> Working with the Nova Corps is the right thing to do. You're being a greedy little rodent right now. Oh, as if you're so high and mighty, green lady. You suddenly forgot all the innocent people you murdered for that psycho? I remember each and every one. Hey, Rocket, cut it out. Way too far. You kidding me with this, Pete? This is why I need a friggin' break. It's Peter's call, Rocket. Not yours. Enjoy staring at my furry backside, chumps. Well, that's not good. <sighs> oh, man. Is everything on this ship broken? Hey, Drax. <sighs> Quill. About... What happened last night? Do you truly mean what you implied? That I did not earn my vengeance? All that matters is that Thanos is gone. Doesn't matter who pulled the trigger. <sighs> I suppose that is logical. You know, I've never asked. Hovat and Camaria. What were they like? My wife and daughter. They were... kind. Brave, true, qualities I, myself, aspire to possess. Ask me no more of them, Peter. I do not always wish to remember their faces. Giving those blades the old polish, huh? They had one purpose, to slay Thanos. And they did not. You're not thinking about quitting, are you? There is nothing left for me to quit. All right. Take care of yourself, buddy. that view. Hey, Mom. <laughs> Had this bag since I was a kid. Used to hold candy. Now it holds... Well, now it holds alien candy.
I always knew I'd make headlines someday. Just didn't think it'd be for killing a giant purple tyrant. No, you. Who did? You did. And about to be someone else's problem. That terminal took a beating in the crash. Still offline. Gotta use the one on the bridge. Well, you just, uh, you hang in there, pal. We're gonna get through this together, okay? I... am... Root. Hey, Rocket. Move along, Pete. Go talk to your buddy, Gamora. I got nothing to say to you. It's just you and me now, Nebula. We should... I don't know. Catch up? About what, Gamora? How you killed our father? You left us no Stay choice. Stay away from me. Hey, Peter. How are you doing? Fine. Staying as far away from Rocket as I can. Oh, he and Drax are really in a mood today. Whatever you said to them last night really got under their skin. So, something on your mind? So, you still mad at Rocket? He needs to watch his little tongue. I... may have been too harsh with him. He just... oh, he's so infuriating. Why do you like the Nova Corps so much? I don't... really like to talk about it, but... I was an assassin for Thanos. I killed so many people for him that I lost count. Tyrants. Innocents. <sighs> Didn't matter. If you ever hear the ridiculous nickname, the most dangerous woman in the universe, that was me. But the Nova Corps, they turned a blind eye to my past after I joined the Guardians. Being with you guys, making the galaxy safer, it's my chance to make up for what I did. I, uh, I checked in with Drax and Rocket. And? Kind of a mixed bag, really. 
That's reassuring. I guess I'll talk to you later. Some advice for you. Don't trust the Collector. You should call the Nova Corps. Okay, Novacore. Star Lord, we thought you were dead. How the hell did you survive? Hardly any of our soldiers made it out. Well, it was touch and go, but the Guardians had my back. Yeah, speaking of which, I have something you might be interested in. I got Thanos lying right here, really dead, smelling up the place. Now, I understand there's some kind of bounty. On him? Is that right? You have his body? <laughs> I can't believe it. We'll dispatch some officers to your location. Nova Corps out. What? We could have gotten way more units with the Collector. What were you thinking, Pete? I rolled out the red carpet for you, and you took a friggin' nosedive. Come on, Rocket. We're heroes. Why don't we act like it? Turning Thanos' body into the Nova Corps? It's the right call. You know, if being a hero requires us to be poor, count me out. I am Groot. Groot says you did the right thing. Yada, yada, yada. I say we totally missed out on a big score. Thank you, Groot. Shut up, Rocket. Fine. You want to suck up to the space cops? Be my guest. But I ain't going with you. Calm down, Rocket. Look, how about we throw in that relic? That'll give us a little extra. <laughs> I guess. Every little bit helps. Ah, oh, come on. Where did I put that thing? Found you. Peter! Oh, I'm 
gonna kill him. Ugh. She broke it, Mom. That doesn't mean it was okay to hit that boy. Violence isn't the answer to every problem. If I let him push me around, it'll only get worse. You're right. You should stand up for yourself. But you need to find a way to do that without getting suspended. You gave me this for my birthday. I mean, you should be pissed <laughs> off too. <clears throat> and what he did was wrong, but... But you, you don't just go punching every person who makes you mad. Especially not someone who's three grades above you. I mean, that kid practically shaves. What? I could have taken him. Uh-uh, don't get cocky, kid. I'm thinking from the look of things, he took you. This can't keep happening, Peter. I know I haven't been home as much lately, but that's all the more reason I need you to step up and take some responsibility. I know. Then you know tomorrow you're apologizing to that boy. And I mean a real apology. I'm not apologizing to him. That guy was an a -hole. Peter! Language! I only said A, Mom. Come on. Uh-huh. You and I both know what that letter means. You're making it real hard to see your side of this. When you act this way, it's like you're only thinking of yourself. What we need... is a little perspective. Sometimes it takes stepping back from your problems to see how small they actually are. Beautiful. <coughs> These last few months haven't been easy for either of us, but um, I'm not always gonna be here. I worry about you. Don't worry about me, Mom. I'll never stop worrying about you. You're gonna be around long after I'm gone. I just don't want you to be alone. <coughs> Mom? <coughs> I'm fine, baby. It's just the dust. I know you've got a lot on your mind. But that kid you fought, maybe he does too. Promise me in the future you'll use your words instead of your fists. I will, Mom. I promise. Thank you, baby. You fixed it! Hell! What can I say, huh? I'm pretty good. Hey! Oh, great song. Someone with exceptional taste must have introduced you to this one. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay? You've just been standing there, talking to this thing. That was incredibly weird. What was weird? I'm not really sure. It's been hours. Hours? The Nova Corps are here. Okay. Uh, yeah. You look like you just saw a ghost. Something isn't right. Never mind. It, it, it was nothing. It was... it was just a dream. It doesn't sound like nothing. <sighs> when I grabbed the relic, I... I was suddenly back on Earth. And my... mom was there. Peter? Your mother is dead. I know. I, I know. I know she is. I just... Somehow it didn't feel that way. We can't keep the Nova Corps waiting. But I do not trust this thing. No way we're selling it. All right. Showtime. Let's go.
thank you, Guardians, for bringing Thanos' body straight to us. We know the Collector was quite interested in purchasing his remains. Probably to put in that hellish zoo of his. But we will dispose of the body properly. Well, sometimes you have to do the right thing. No matter how difficult and dangerous and noble it is. The galaxy is in your debt, Star-Lord. As are we. Once we have verified Thanos' corpse, the bounty is yours. While we're here, I've just got to say, I'm a big fan of yours, Star-Lord. You took out the Mad Titan. Yeah, okay. Uh, could we just transfer these units and, you know, move it along? Uh, of course, of course. Uh, the process is almost complete. Oh, are you kidding me with this? Amateurs. Confirmed. Thanos the Mad Titan. Great. We'll take that bounty now, Space Cop. Oh, of course. Okay, once the body has been received by processing, the bounty will be released to accounting. You should start receiving your payment in installments in... six to twelve months. Ugh, I know. Standard protocol. Oh, come on, man. Help me out here. I mean, can't my biggest fan speed things up a little? Well, <laughs> um... I might be able to pull some strings, but, um... In return, I, I, I have a small favor to ask. Just like tiny, tiny favor. Uh, can I, um, <clears throat> um, touch your gun? I, I've always wanted to. Uh, let's not make this weird. Oh, oh, oh no, no, I, I didn't mean to make it weird. Mm, I am Groot. Yeah, he says it's very weird. And we're all done here. It's been an honor working with you, Star-Lord. Peter Quill. Oh, what now? You have something I desire. The Eternity Forge! Alright, the body is in the And since Jinzar could not retrieve it earlier, I must take it myself. I will not fail you again, Hala. Retrieve the relic. Can you actually shoot? Speak, kid. Is that a yes? Ah, just follow me. You're so incredible.
mine. Have what we came for. Stop! Rocket, we need the ship. The engines are down. It's gonna take a minute. We can't wait. They're getting away. I'm coming with you. There's only one pack. Allow me to fight beside you, Star Lord. I did not kill Thanos. At least let me kill these blue warriors. Look at the size of that warship. You can't fight your way through that. Take me, and they'll never even know you were there. Let us paint her ship red with blood from the inside. <laughs> Suit up, Drax. You and your blades are with me. I shall be a worthy, violent ally. Don't let him do anything stupid. Quiet, Drax. Did you not understand? I understood you, Quill. I do not wish to be quiet. Let's just find Hala and get that relic back. How are the engines looking? Not great, Pete. The old girl's seen better days. Hey, Groot, don't stick your roots in that. Hey, Gamora, how, how are you guys holding up? I should ask you the same. We're safe and sound on Nowhere. You're inside an enemy warship. Ah, don't worry. I'm keeping Drax safe. I hear your lies, Quill. Dead? 
No chance of a warrior's death. What was the point in coming here? Okay. Look, I know you're going through something here, but I need you to get it together. As you command, let us continue on. Feeling. For once, I am grateful for Hovat's death. She cannot witness my greatest shame. I should have died in battle with Thanos. I have failed her. I didn't realize this was bothering you that much. Why, why didn't you tell me? It is my shame to bear, not yours. Drax, I... We have wasted enough time. We should concern ourselves with the matter at hand. Much better. The bridge. Hala's gotta be there. Which means, that's where the relic is. Power diverted to access way. 36 stasis pods now offline. Equilibrium terminated. Uh. My bad. Do not feel bad. The dead cannot become more dead. Thanks for leaving me one. You are welcome. All right, let's. Oh. Okay. Now. Come on, man. He has finally expired. Let's go get the relic.
Make haste, Star-Lord. We must reach the bridge and slaughter everyone in our path. Who is next to die? Do not worry, sweet one. You shall be back by my side soon. Once we return home, the process can begin. You are with me and return for more. Peter Quill. It's pronounced Star-Lord. One more step and he dies. It will be easy to <clears throat> remove his head. Do not test me. Get that thing off his neck. Very well. <gasps> I cannot lose my son again. You will not take him from me. I have been searching for so long. I just want the relic. That's it. They are one and the same. Thanos eradicated my people. Destroyed my planet. Now that you have killed him, the Eternity Forge will be our salvation. You have no idea what this means to me. To the Kree. Your people, they... They're all dead. That relic can't help them. Not if the myths are true. You really do not know how this works, do you? The Forge requires a sacrifice. Would you kill someone to bring a loved one back? No. I'd never do that. I thought as you once did. Until everything was taken from me. Billions of Kree have died. Bringing them all back will require many sacrifices. I will not rest until we have conquered every star system in the galaxy. Starting with you. Rocket, we must leave! 
Apollo's ship is in pursuit. I don't know if we can outrun her. Then we shall fight our way out. Peter is gravely injured. Oh, does PDQ have a boo-boo? Tell that was to walk it up. Oh, no. I am Groot? I don't know, buddy. I hope so. Hey, guys. You should have been there to protect him, Drax. This is your fault. You would have fared no better, Green Witch. And you, Rodent. What did you say? Yeah, go on. Blame the guy who rescued him. I am Groot. Peter, you don't know. I'll give you some time to say goodbye. You know, your mom would smack you upside the head she saw you moping over her like this. Quills ain't no little babies. My mom just... My mama et three of my brothers. I'd have been happy to see her go. Ha! You better pull it together, boy. Because I'm the closest thing you got to family right now. Now let's get... Are you... My dad? <laughs> no. Your ma wrote me into taking care of you if something ever happened. Something happened. Now, you can come with me easy, or am I gonna have a fight on my hands? Won't do you much good. Are you... Are you threatening me? Oh, it's not a threat. What I say, I do. There's nothing in between. So what's it gonna be? I I'm not going anywhere with you. Come here! Uh, hey! You keep this up, and I'm gonna have to eat you! What? Don't worry, my little Star-Lord. I'm here to help you. It'll be all right. Oh. Is that really you? You'll understand soon. Mom? Come find me, Peter. I'll be waiting for you.
Everybody here. Hmm. This thing recording? Okay, so, yeah. I thought once Thanos was kaput, we'd have to change our name. Heroes of the Galaxy. Partyers of the Galaxy. Huh. Yeah, but the thing about this place? It never stays guarded for long. As soon as Hala found out we had the Eternity Forge, we shot up to Numero Uno on her murder list. Yes, dying hurt. A lot. What kind of question is that? Mm, I am... Yeah, uh, you know what, buddy? Why don't I feel these questions? Since we're putting this on record, it was a brilliant idea to pawn off Thanos. But I ain't thrilled those idiots at the Nova Corps ended up with them. You see units pouring out of my ears? Cause I don't! Oh, Quill's been a pain in my ass since day one. Since minute one when he came aboard my ship. Soon as he showed up at my hideout, I could tell he got himself in some kind of trouble. The Kree ain't folks you want to mess with. I thought my reunion with Nebula would go over better. That she'd understand I was trying to mend things between us. I was wrong. Once she found out what the Eternity Forge could do, everything it could do, there was no stopping her. I'm gonna use an Earth analogy here, so just bear with me. The Guardians, we're like the Beatles. I'm John, Gamora is Paul, Rocket is Ringo, Drax is George, and Groot, well... Well, Groot is just Groot. It's, it's, it's not a perfect analogy, all right? <laughs> we yell, sure. We fight. But damn, do we make beautiful music. I just hope I can keep the band together. Or this galaxy doesn't stand a chance. Stop with it's like magic. 